If you're often in a rush in the morning and you end up skipping breakfast, that's not a good thing. So I've got a really good recipe for you all to do and you can take it away with you to work or you can eat it quickly in the morning. Um, I'm going to do it in a Tupperware so that you do have it ready to go in the morning and you can just shoot out the door with it. Okay, so it's overnight oats. I've got um, about three quarters of a cup of oats just put into a Tupperware, nice and dry. Then we've got just a mixture of things that I quite like having in my porridge. So I've got some linseed, coconut flakes, sunflower seeds, some raisins, and a little pinch of cinnamon as well, because it just adds a little bit of uh, extra taste to it. But you can put in anything that you like. Um, you can always put in fresh berries or bananas, and it just soaks up through the night. So we're just gonna pour that all into there. Right, then we've got about three quarters of a cup of uh, almond milk. Again, I'm using almond milk just because a lot of people are allergic to dairy products and almond milk is a really, really good health product, really good for you, so I would always use it over dairy milk anyways. Every time I say dairy milk, it sounds like a chocolate, so don't, don't do that either. <laughs> right, and just a little squeeze of honey just for the sweetness. Round we go. It only needs a dash, you don't need to overkill on the, on the honey because obviously it has got quite a lot of um, sugar in, but it's a good natural sugar. So you just got to mix it all through. Now it's really dependent on you as the person. If you like your oats really, really thick, then you don't want as much liquid. And if you like them a little bit thinner, then you get more liquid in there. So at the moment, it looks like a load of slodge, but by the morning, it will all be soaked up really nice and thick, and it saves you spending 10 minutes on the stove in the morning, and you can run out the door with this. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe to FIT. We'll come into our first posture of cat and cow. So coming into all fours. And then we'll inhale and gaze forward 